the number 15 Sunbirds looking to make their 14th straight victory, taking on Notre Dame Dana Muir, the Argonauts from Belmont, California. And this one was all Fresno Pacific. Early in the first set, it's Morgan Williams with the beautifully placed shot to tie the match up at 2-2. Later in the set, Erica Adachi sets up Jesse Alcorn, who rockets the attack down the line for the kill. Sunbirds lead 18-9. Kara Mitchell now with the cross-court shot, one of her five kills on the night. FPU takes set one 25-14. Second set now, Williams again, this time with the solo block back at the Argonauts, one of her three blocks on the night. Set point for FPU and Kathleen Anderson closes it out for the Sunbirds in the set 25-19. Third set, Sunbird up big again and Emily Caro getting some work on the outside gets the kill here. She's followed by Hoopia Inc. with a trademark rocket shot that goes off the Argos and out for the kill. Match point for Fresno Pacific and Kathleen Anderson gets her seventh kill of the night. And that was the game ender. Sunbird sweep Notre Dame 3-0. I think it's really important um, that we have a really... Uh... We have a really deep team. Like we have a lot of players that can come in and uh, do their job, and it gives other people a break. And uh, I think it just shows how good we are as a team that anyone can play any night. So we're on a great win streak. The team is doing really good at maintaining um, the ability to play to our level and work on some things that uh, we wouldn't be able to work on otherwise. Um, if we're having to always gear up for a big match, you know, we're trying some new things, trying some new lineups, and we have that opportunity right now. But uh, the team's, you know. The wins are there, and it's amazing. The team's doing great, but uh, we're definitely looking at the end of October and November, and we're gearing up for those big matches. You know, it's exciting. We, you know, every Monday we look at it and we're like, yay, you know, but uh, it's one of those things where we have to be good over time. And uh, right now it's only been about two thirds of the season. We got to get good at the end here. And that's when it uh, really matters is can we be good when it counts, you know, in November and December?